The first Noel the angel did say Was to certain poor shepherds in fields as they lay In fields where they Hi everyone! I hope you're all having an amazing day. So today I'm going to be filming the What I Got for Christmas 2015 tag and this video is such an addicting video to watch and I'm honestly not sure why but it's just a really fun video to watch and actually just yesterday was Christmas so I'm filming this like right after all that like Christmas joy and excitement and yesterday was a really really fun day and I hope it was just an amazing day for all of you guys just to spend with your friends and your family and a huge disclaimer before I start the video is that I'm not trying to brag in any way shape or form I honestly just love sharing my presents with you guys and I love watching this video and obviously the true meaning of Christmas is definitely not the presents and the true meaning of Christmas is that we're just celebrating the Lord Jesus' birth and it's just a huge birthday party for him and he is obviously the greatest gift that I could ever receive um, but these are just some other gifts that my friends and my family gave me, so I hope you guys will enjoy this video and let's get started. Okay, I'm going to start off with what my sisters got me. So my younger sister got me this scarf and it's from Forever 21 and it's just like a really colorful knitted material and I thought this was just a really thoughtful gift and she also got me a bunch of other gifts, but I can't show you guys all the gifts I got because that will really be like an hour long video and so I was going to show you guys like my favorite things from her so she just got me the scarf which is really really pretty and cute and very thoughtful of her. My other sister got me some canvases and they just have really cute quotes on them. This one says hope those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength and it's just a really nice canvas to hang up in my room. I have a canvas in the back I don't know if you can tell but I have a canvas back there, also like a Bible verse quote, which is really nice. Um, this one says, faith without faith, nothing is possible. With it, nothing is impossible. And so again, just really, really cute, sweet, thoughtful gifts. Okay, so from my mom, she did get me a lot of different things, but I'm just going to again show you like some of my favorite things. So I've been wanting some new bedding, not like the whole bed sets, but just like a nice like throw to put on top of my bed. And so... I asked for this and came in. I'm just opening it right now. It's so nice. This is the Lauren Conrad Faux Fur Throw. And it's like in this pale pink blush color. And it is just so beautiful. And it's so soft. I love it so much. So I just got this throw. Next for my mom are these pairs of Puma sneakers, which I am really excited for because this, along with the throw, is things that I like specifically asked for. And it's because my old sneakers I have right now are really old and dirty and I'm basically just going to toss them out really soon. So these are like really nice for like everyday walking too. And they just look like this. They're like a pale pink blush color and they're just so pretty. And I don't have a pair of like everyday sneakers so these are definitely just nice to have. My mom also got me another pair of shoes and these are from the brand White Mountain and these are just like really pretty heels and these are for like more summertime or like springtime shoes but I can't to wear them. They just look like this and they just have like a chunky heel right here which are so much better than like stilettos. Stilettos literally are so hard to walk in but chunky heels are way easier to walk in. And they just have a cute buckle and they're just like this beigey nude color with a peep toe and a bunch of cutouts as you can see. So I'm really excited to wear these. So thank you mom for everything. So my other aunt gave me this really pretty necklace. Like it is so pretty for like the summertime because it's like a festival-ish necklace. And it's just like two chevron like travel print and with a bunch of like fringe and it's like a longer necklace and I actually really do love long necklaces and if you're wondering the brand it's the brand is called full tilt I don't know but it's just really really cute necklace and I'm really thankful for this so thank you so much it's just really really pretty so she also got me this jacket from the same brand full tilt and it's so warm it's like the hood is fur I don't know if you can tell because it's like black but it's really soft fur 
and I'm not sure what the style is called. It's from Tilly's and it's called the Fleece Anorak with Hood. So it's like a mini anorak and I've always wanted an anorak so it's really cool and it's such a thick and warm jacket and it's going to be really nice for the winter time. From the St. Aunt she also gave me this really pretty clutch and it's just white with like some kind of travel print, I don't know if you guys see that. And like the best part is like the, what's it called, the tassel, it has a bunch of like white faux leather fringe on it and the hardware is gold and it just zips open and you have some compartments inside which is really nice and it's just it's a really good size clutch also i don't really have a lot of clutches so this is definitely nice to add to my collection okay so the next gift is for my other aunt and she she just picks out the best items honestly she's such an amazing like gift picker i don't know but anyways she got me this Kind of like dress slash tunic i'm not really sure um it's from olivia and it's just like this really pretty marled color and it looks like this and it goes down and it's very flowy at the bottom which i really like and the material is really really soft and it's just a really nice winter type of dress slash tunic i'm not really sure i don't know because i'm just not used to wearing like short dresses and it's not like a super short Thing. it's pretty long but it's just really nice to wear she also got me another dress and this one is so pretty as well it is from the brand American rack and it basically looks like this it's a really high neck top which I it's okay it's becoming a trend but I really like this trend because I feel like it's a very classy trend and it's definitely a really cute trend and it just goes down like this and it's like a chiffon material and it's like a black floral pattern and it's very like vintage inspired which I really like and it has a black belt and I just really really like this dress so thank you so much so for my other aunt she got me a couple of like gap sweaters and they are so nice I love this one this one is just like a white oversized sweater and I really like the neckline because it's like I don't know what to say it's like very really loose but it's not like a baggy neckline but it's just like loose fitting kind of like a loose scoop neck and just really really comfy and nice basic sweaters okay so the last clothing piece I have to show you is also from another aunt and it's like I got a lot of cardigans this year for Christmas and this one is like probably my favorite and it's just so big Right now it looks like I'm just holding open a big black blanket. <laughs> Basically it's probably going to feel like that when I'm wearing it, which is awesome. That's definitely how I want my clothes to feel like a blanket all the time. But it's from the brand Divided from H&M and it's basically, I think those long cardigans are like called long duster cardigans, I think that's what they're called. But this one is one of those cardigans that just go on forever. And it has pockets too, which is awesome because pockets make everything awesome. Am I right? Okay, so that was all the clothing items that I just showed you and I'm just so thankful for all that I've gotten. So thank you to all my aunts and uncles for getting me those amazing gifts. I'm really just blessed and thankful for them. So now I'm going to show you guys the makeup gifts I received. Most of these are from my mom. One of them is from my sister because she actually got this Christmas gift and then she gave one to me. So. Yeah, so I'm going to show you guys some makeup gifts. So the first makeup gift I have to show you is mascara, and this is the Benefit Bagal Lash Mascara. And it's really cool because it's like black and pink packaging. Yeah, that's why I think it's so cool. Yeah, I haven't opened it yet. I think I'm going to save this because I really hate when mascaras dry up because they just need to stay moist for me. And... Yeah, so I'm really excited to be using this mascara, so thank you so much, Mom. Okay, she also gave me another mascara. I'm actually wearing it right now, which you can't see because I have glasses on. Yeah. Um, but I wore it last night, too, and it's such a good mascara. I really like it. It's the Clinique High Impact Mascara. I'll show you guys. You probably can't see it, but it's a really, really nice mascara, and it just makes your lashes... Oh. And it just makes your lashes look really nice and long and it definitely does not clump your lashes up which is really good because 
sometimes you really love mascara but then it makes your lashes look so clumped up and you're just like no why but this one definitely does not do that my mom also got me the soft lips cube lip balm and oh my gosh this is so cool it's basically like a baby eos inside of a cube that might sound a little weird but it's basically just that it's so cool it's in the um scent pomegranate blueberry and i'll show you what it looks like I haven't opened it up yet but you know that little white thing is the lip balm and i am so excited to be using this but i need to use up some other lip balms before i open this one up from my mom she all motorcycle thought Please. From my mom, she also gave me this really nice brush set, and it's from the brand Color Science Pro, and it's called the On The Go Brush Set, and it comes with a liner brush, concealer brush, shaper brush, blending brush, and a blush brush, which is really nice, and quickly open it for you guys. And honestly, I was probably needing new brushes. I've been using my makeup brushes now since, like, two years ago, and they're from Ulta, so... These will be really nice to replace some of them. The brush that I use the most is a concealer brush. Um, I don't wear blush, but I'm sure the eyeshadow brushes will be really nice to put into use. So thank you so much, Mom. Okay, so the last makeup product I have to show you guys is a little lip crayon. And if you watched my holiday makeup tutorial, you would have seen me use a lip crayon. I have so many lip crayons. I They're just so easy to use. And I love this one. This one is from MAC. And I'm not sure what color. Oh, it's called Revved Up Patten Polish Lip Pencil. I think, I don't know, it just looks like this. And it's kind of like an orangey apricot color. And it's like a nudish basic color, but I wear a lot of reds and like sparkly colors. And yeah, so it's definitely nice to have a bit more of a basic lip color. So that was it for my What I Got For Christmas 2015 video. If you guys liked it, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. And also comment down below what was your favorite thing to do during this Christmas season. Um, let me think, what was my favorite thing to do this Christmas season? Honestly, for me this season, or this Christmas season, my favorite thing to do was probably just decorate my house for Christmas because, I don't know, it's just, it just is a really fun thing for me to do and my room if you can look at it right now it's all sparked out sparked out it's all like decorated out and i don't know if you can see but i have a little gingerbread up there and like lights so definitely decorating my room for christmas is just a lot of fun to me if you guys could just please subscribe to my channel that would just mean the absolute world to me i am just starting out my youtube channel and I would love it just to have it grow and um, yeah it's just it's a new thing for me and honestly I never would have ever thought that I've ever started a YouTube channel but I have and that's just my brush set falling to the ground but anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video um, I do have another video planned to go up next week about New Year's but if you guys have any specific New Year's video requests such as like a makeup tutorial or like New Year's resolution ideas or anything like that and tell me in the comments below. I hope you guys will all have an amazing, amazing day and yeah.